families of four suspected criminals who were gunned down last week in Barut, Nakuru, are demanding justice for their kin after a post-mortem examination revealed the suspects were shot at close range. Speaking moments after an autopsy was conducted on the bodies of Collins Kibet, Kevin Kipiagon, Dennis Kipchirchir and Collins Kipkorir, Human rights activists who accompanied the family members called for speedy investigations into Thursday night's incident that left the four dead. Sources intimated to Citizen TV that the autopsy report revealed that the four had gunshot wounds and there were no signs of torture or handcuffs. Nakuru Police Commander Peter Mwanzo, however, reiterated that the police acted according to the law and that criminal gangs will be wiped out in the ongoing security operation. Kevin na Dennis ni mandugu zangu walikuwa ananifuata nyuma na waliwawa tu na tujui kiini yake ni nini lakini nilikuwa naomba serikali mtu akipatikana na makosa mtu achukuliwe sheria we fully support the fight against crime we fully support you know the fight against insecurity no one wants any group of criminals running around attacking women and killing them no one wants that but the manner in which you fight insecurity cannot be through cold-blooded executions. We're going to do exactly what you're supposed to do, and we are going to operate within law. It's simple, simple as that. And anyone making noise regarding this maybe require some investigation. They could be, they could be equally benefiting from the proceeds of uh, this criminal criminality or this criminal.